Good morning, everybody. We'll get started in just a few minutes. Just wait for a few of you to pop on, roll out of bed. If you're here now, you do need, um, this is Bar Boot Camp, 45 minutes. You do need two cans or water bottles. So canned goods, water bottles. Um, if you have two to three pound weights, that's fine too. Um, so grab those, make sure you have a chair close by. Um, and then an option for a towel or blanket when we get to our little floor section um, for some support on your back. So it's not necessary. Um, if you have back issues, I definitely recommend grabbing something. If you have one of the um, bar balls, that's great too. So just another minute till we get started. Does anybody else like rearrange their room for working out? I always move the couches. All right, well, good morning. What a crappy day. Um, but thank you for joining me this morning. I'm waking up, getting out of bed to join me for some bar boot camp. My name is Kara, um, and we are gonna get rolling. So if you're just hopping on, welcome. Make sure you grab two cans or water bottles and a chair, and we are gonna start with the warm up. If you were here last week and did my bar boot camp, we're doing a similar format, um, just some different exercises and stuff. So we have a warm up, set one, cardio burst, set two, cardio, three, cardio, and then we're done. So 45 minutes, let's get rolling. Put on your music if you want music, and let's get started. Let me switch my angle. It's always crazy going live on two devices. All right, so we're gonna start with our heels under our hips. Just rock your uh, feet, ugh, shift your weight forward and back, just to kind of find your center. Bend your knees, take a big inhale, lift up, and down, do that again. Inhale, lift, and down. Give me two more here. Big reach. Good, and one more. Lift. Good, so now we're gonna go for 30 seconds of a plie with a tendu. Just get my watch ready. So the move is plie, tendu, plie, tendu. And start. So we're just bending the knees, pointing the foot out to the side. Down and tap. If you want to add the upper body, we just add a little reach. We're just warming up the legs, warming up the upper body. I know most of us just woke up, so we're just getting moving. Five seconds here. Three, two, and one. Single knee lift. So just lift your knee up and down. Just the first round, we'll add arms in the second set. So just lift that knee. You want to aim higher than your hip. Leaning back slightly, bracing the core. Just moving the feet. Moving the legs. 10 seconds left, then we're gonna go back to our plie and tendu. This time in first position, turned out. Three, two, one. Feet together, open up those toes, heels together. That's your turn out. We go plie, tendu, plie, Tendu. Now, if you're starting to feel a little bit warmer, you can take that leg a little bit higher to a low bottom up. So just a low kick. Or you can stay with that tendu. Tap. Good, my ankles are cracking. Just waking up, getting moving. Three, two, and one. Back to our knees. This time, opposite elbow to your knee. So we're getting a little bit of a rotation here through the core. Good, from the side, looks like this. Almost like a standing crunch. Three, two, one. This time, second position, turned out. We go back to our plie, tendu. Plie, tendu, plie, tendu. 
So you're shifting your weight. Remember, if you want to add that low kick, that's fine too. It's just the warm up, nothing crazy to start, right? We're starting to breathe a little bit. Starting to take that heart rate up slightly. Nice work, guys. Five more seconds here. Three, two, one. Back to your knees. This time, reach and pull. Reach and pull. So this time, we're warming up through the back and the shoulders. We have a lot of shoulder work today. So we gotta get ready for it. Can you lean back slightly? Nice work, guys. Keep it up. Only 30 seconds. Last five, four, three, two, and rest. Good. That's your warm up. So we're moving into our first round of work. This is our standing section. All you need is your weights. So if you have two to three pound dumbbells, grab those. I do not. Canned goods work fine. Water bottles as well. I'll show you the three moves first and then we'll go through them. The first one, we're going to be in the first position. Turned out we have a plie with a side and front raise. So we go side, front, side, front. Then we pause for four, three, two, one. And then we'll do that again. Front, side, front, side. Four, three, two, one. Pause. So that's our first move. Second move, you're going to come down to the floor kneeling. Opposite leg to arm for a tricep extension. And then the last move, you're going to come up to a wide second position, and we're going to alternate our bicep curls, okay? So we're going to start with that first move. We're going to do this together. So first position, shoulders down and back. We go side, front, side, front, pops for four, and then we repeat it. Keep that knee bend. Three, two, one, let's go. Side, front, side, front, pulse it out for four. Three, two, one. And again, we go front, side, front, side. We pulse it four. Three, two, one. You got it. Nice soft elbows. Pulse it. Four, three, two. Keep the chest up. Keep your neck long. Two, one. We pulse four, three, two. One, keep it going, out and up. We keep the knees bending, keep the legs working just a little bit. Awesome, keep it up. We're starting to feel a slight burn. Four, three, two, one, keep it up. Awesome, keep it moving. Keep those arms working. Four, three. We have one more each way. We go out and front. Out and front to the side. Pulse four, three, two. One more set. Take it up. Front, side, front, side. Four, three, two, one. Awesome. Come on down. So. One arm is down. The arm that has the can, the opposite leg extends for balance. If you don't want that, keep the knees under the hips. Elbow in, we go out, in, tricep extension. But we're also working the shoulders, working the core. If that leg extension is too much, you can come down right here. Now, I want you to think about keeping your elbow in line with your shoulder and we're just extending out and in, out and in. Awesome, keep it up. Four more, three, two. Now we're gonna slow it down, slow extension. Go for four, three, two, one. Bring it in for four, three, two. It's almost harder to go slower again. Slow extension. We're isolating that tricep 
and it's starting to shake. Two more slow. Take it out. Four, three, two, one. Down. Four, three. Now ten singles. Here we go. Out and in. Two.
from your head like a string is pulling you straight up. One more time. Front, side. Front, side. Pulse it out. For four, three, two, one. Hold. Come on down. Tricep extension. Opposite arm is leg. We go singles out and in. Lift, lower. Now that leg extension stays in line with your hips, so we don't want to kick it up high and we don't want to drop it down low. We want to keep it right in line. Remember, if that's too much, both knees down, up and in. On this extension, I really want you to focus on controlling. So staying in, controlling it down up. I don't want to see swinging. It's all about the control. That's going to help isolate that tricep. Good, T. Now let's go slow. Four, three, two, one. In. Four, three, two, one. Four, three. Don't let that leg drop. Four, three, two, one. Two more. In. Four, three, two, one. Last one. All right, team, we got 10 singles. Here we go. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, last two. One more. Good. Switch sides. We go right to singles. 3, 2, one singles, here we go. Out and in. Nice control. Elbow stays lifted. Focusing on that extension, stopping right at the hip. Choices if you need. If you have any back issues as well, you want to probably stay with both knees down. Keep it up. Four. Three, two, and super slow. Take it out for four. Three, two, one, and four. Three, two, one. Again, four, three, two, one, four, three, two. More like that. Here we go. Four, three, two, one, and slow. Three, two, one, four, three. Two, one, in, four, three, now, ten singles, here we go, ten, in, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one, stand up, second position, alternating curls, here we go, take it up, and down, lift, and lower. Awesome, nice bend in the knees. Pressing the knees right over the toes. Try not to let your knees cave in. Push them out, stay up. Awesome. You got it. Keep the curl, keep it going. I know it's starting to burn just a little bit. One more each side. Now both together, here we go, up and down. Lift and lower. Come on, where's that knee bend? Drop down one inch, you got it. Four, three, two, we pulse it up and down, up, down, up, down. So just that top half into the shoulders and three inches down. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Let's go, one more set. Three, two, one, let's go. Take it out and up. Out and up, four pulses. Four, three, two, one, again. Out and pulse. Four, three, two, one. Again. Up, out, pulse. Four. Pulse. Four, 
we go. Up. And up. Just wait. There's more shoulder work later. Don't worry. Pulse. Four. One more time. Up. Up. My one dog's crying over there because I locked him up because he gets in my face when I do push-ups. <laughs> Three, two, one. Come on down. Chest extension. <coughs> Control, guys, stay with it. Three, two, 
One, rest for 10 seconds. Come down to the floor. <coughs> Hands under the shoulders. Three, two, thread the needle. So you're walking the feet. Option here is to just hold that plank, knees or toes. Keep the hands under the shoulders, abs are braced. Stay with it halfway. This is a sneaky way to get that heart rate up. Bring that knee in and then cross it over. Three, two, one. Stand up, one more set. Back to the jacks. Five seconds left. Three, two, one. Go out, in. If you wanna make it harder, Hands overhead. Remember to roll through the feet. Soft landing. If you live in an apartment, you don't want to be banging at your neighbor right underneath. Choices are here. 10 seconds. Three, two, one. Rest. Thread the needles. In five, three, two, let's go. Bring that knee in first and then cross. It's almost like a mountain climber, but we add that little bit of dancey feel to it. Remember your options? We can just hold knees or toes. Keep it up, guys. Five seconds left. Three, two, one. Stand up. All right, drink if you need, rest. We go to our chair. Grab your chair, bring it on in. A chair, anything you can use for balance. Franklin, why are you whining? Can we get out? right into it. So I feel like that first set took a long time. Single lunges. Here we go. Take it down and up. Your back knee is dropping straight down and we're just using this for balance. So not all your weight should be on the bench or bar or whatever you have. Nice long stride. Drop your knees straight down. Five more here. Four. Three. Two, last one. Watch the change. We go out in. Join me now. We take it squat, lunge, squat, lunge. That back heel lifts up to rotate in. Your hips go with you. Out, in, out, in. Reach the arm to add a little bit of upper body. Three, two, and one, hold here. Now, slight bend in your knee, reach that toe. We go up and down, up and down. So supporting legs, slight bend. That's gonna isolate that quad. Hip stays square. Up and down, little tap. Five more here, four, three, two, one. Up and pulse, pulse. Pulse, pulse. You should be starting to feel those glutes. Remember, slight bend, working this side and this side at the same time. Five, four, we are not done yet. We bend and extend, we go. Bend, extend, bend, extend. Now we start to incorporate that hamstring, hello. While this leg stays bent. So this glute is feeling it too, right? I know you're all nodding your heads at home, right? Come on, 10 more. Nine, eight, seven. If you need a break, you stop, you come back. Six, five, four, three, 
two, and one. Hello, legs. They're awake now. Switch sides. I'm just switching so you can see me. Other leg, step back. We start with our lunge. Here we go. Take it down and up, down. We want two 90 degree angles in our legs. So if you're super close, that's gonna take that knee over that toe forward as you see in the front, and that's gonna cause tension on your knee, which we don't want. Nice, long stride. Back is straight. Feel that string pull you. I hope you didn't stop. You should have been going still. <laughs> Push through that front heel. Five more. Four, three, two, and one. To the squat we go. Squat and lunge. Squat and lunge. Reach. Swivel that on the ball of the foot. Four more. Three. Two, and one. Hold up and down, up and down with that tap. Slight bend, straight leg, back straight. Now you know if you need a break, take a break. You can join us when you're ready. Just don't pause me. Keep it up. Up and down. Five, four, three, two, let's pulse it up. Up, up, pulse, pulse. Come on. Ah, uh, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Bend it out. In, out, in, out. Feel that hamstring start to engage. Imagine you're squeezing something between your knee and the back. There you go. Stay with it. In, out. Don't forget that bend in the front leg so we can isolate that side as well. Five, four, three, two, one. Woo, breathe, switch. Other side. Two more sets. We'll go a little faster this time. Three, two, one. Single lunge. Take it down and up. Down and up. Awesome. Nice long stride. Back heels lifted. You got five, four, three. We're just holding out for balance, so not too much pressure should be on your chair. Last one. Out and in, take it out, in, out, in, swivel, rotate. Now, you can take this slower if you need to. If you need to pause at each one, that's okay too. It's your workout, you do what makes you feel good. Give me three, two, and one, hold. Up and down, up and down. Whew. Legs are feeling it. Glutes hurt. Feel the burn, guys. Hi, buddy. Three, two, pulse it. Up, up.
all I got yesterday. What do you want, buddy? Five more. Four, three, two, and squat and lunge. Out and in. Out and in. To our floor work and then we'll add it at the end. <coughs> I just had to by today. All right, so if you need a little towel or um, something for back support, grab that. You need your cans for the set as well. So I'll show you the three moves. It's a hover with a knee drop. So elbows under the shoulders. Oh gosh. Move up. Elbows under the shoulders, and you're going to tap the knee down and down and switch. We'll do that for 30 seconds. Our second move, this is where you may want your towel or mat. Move this. For some back support. Here, we have front raise or shoulder raises here, but we're also adding that little crunch. And then the last one is a Russian twist. So... 30 seconds of your hover with the drop. Three, two, one, let's go. Drop, drop, down and up. You got it. Come on. 30 seconds. Keep it going, guys. Taps. 
in three, two, one, start. So elbows underneath the shoulders, tap down. Now, common, we go like this in our hover, but try to spread it like this. So this is where I want your arms. That's gonna take the work more into your core and less tension up here in your shoulders. Draw the shoulders down and back and hold your hover like so. And you'll definitely feel it. Three, two, one. Flip over, grab your support if you need it. Hands, here we alternate. Up and down, up, down, reach. Told you we had that shoulder work coming at the end. Ah, abs are engaged. Five, four, three, two, both thumbs. We go up and down. Now, if this nurse still bothers your back, I want you to sit upright and do it here. Up and down, up and down. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, Russian twist. Twist and lift. Now, if this move still bothers your back, you're just gonna put your hands down and alternate knee lifts. So plenty of choices for you guys to get through it. We got 15 seconds left. And then we have one more set.
Last set, stand up. One more round. Three, two, and one, go. 20 seconds, you got it. drink if you need. We're going to cool it down in just a second. So we're going to come back to the floor. So if you need to grab a drink, go ahead and do so. <coughs> we're going to sit back into a child's pose. Reach the hands long. Sink the hips back. Toes together. So a nice long reach through the back. All right, we're gonna come up. We're gonna take one arm. We're gonna thread it through. Sit on back for a shoulder stretch. We did a lot of shoulder work today. Awesome, go ahead and switch. Other side, thread it through, sit on back. All right, now we're gonna take one leg. We're gonna come through to a pigeon stretch. So, like this. If this is too much, we come here to 90 degree angles. If you're okay here, rotate that hip over and then reach the arms long. So this stretch is all for those glutes. And remember, if that's too much for you, both knees bend and you just reach as far as you can. Everybody's different, every day is different. Awesome, come on up. We'll just switch sides while we're down here. So take the other leg, remember, and one side may be better than the other, maybe a little bit easier, maybe a little bit more challenging. Just take what you need today. This side for me definitely is tighter. All right, go ahead, come on to the knees. We're gonna go back into a downward dog. So cur uh, curl the toes, press the hips up, drop the uh, heels down, lift the hips up. You can bend the knees, pedal the feet to get through the calf and the hamstrings. Now go ahead and walk the hands back, roll up slowly. Good, let's take a quad stretch. Grab your feet, knees together, tuck the hip. Good. Thanks for joining me this morning, guys, especially the ones that caught it live. Thank you for getting out of bed and or wherever, whatever you were doing, if you were working already or whatever. Thanks for joining me, stopping what you're doing, taking a break, starting your day off right. Take those feet wide, reach down, hips up. Bend the knees, roll it up. Ah, take one big inhale. Awesome work, guys. Thanks for joining me this morning. You can find me next on Sunday at 9 a.m. for a 30-minute core class. If you have any requests for that class, please let me know. If you want to incorporate anything else with it, if you just want to do straight core, um, you tell me. It's also Easter Sunday, so just remember that. But it will be um, recorded if you want to do it later. Uh, so have a great day. 
enjoy your Thursday and I will see you guys on Sunday.